Welcome to Old Time Hobbies. After a long absence, we're back on the air. And we're going to do a little break on a box of gi a giant box of Top Series 2 baseball from Target. And we're looking in here for these new exclusive Juan Soto highlight cards. So let's see what we get out of this. I believe, if I remember reading right, it is 16 packs with 16 cards. And this one was a little banged up in the box, so I figured, okay, this is the one we're going to try. Let's see what we get in it. Because I don't like to sell boxes that are banged up. And it's just cushioned air area, so it should be okay. It's a full box, though. Top to bottom. Lots of packs. There we go. Let's see what we get. This is Series 2. We only did one case of this. So let's see what we get here. So many guys have changed teams in the last week. Well, not too bad. First pack has a Jose Abreu... Um, um, vintage card in it and the old paper stock and this one is number 73 of 99 ah there they are Juan Soto home run history card number 20 a 65 of Jacob deGrom. Rookie of Tom Hatch. An Alex Krilloff rookie. And Jeff Mathis. And you can't even, you got to have a scorecard to see who all the players are in the teams now. So many people changed. I mean, you're going to not recognize who the Cubs are. Looks like more like a ninth inning uh, lineup than a... Uh, beginning of the game lineup with the Cubs because nobody's there. You got Hayward and maybe one other guy that were on the team for the World Championship. Everybody else is gone. So, that's the way it goes. Pack number two. Kramer, Andy Young. All right, we have a 65 Cody Bellinger in this one. Hmm, only insert in that pack. Three in the first one and one in the second. Pack number three. All right, so coming up on Monday, 10 o'clock on August 2nd, we'll be putting in a case of Stadium Club, 16 box PYT number one. There's a Cabron Hayes rookie card right there. So that'll be the first. Uh, we're going to do two breaks. Uh, work on two breaks this week. I've got a case of 16 box Stadium Club, 32 on card autos, and I have a case of Gypsy Queen. And that is 10 boxes, so I'll have 20 autos. Most of our cases have been getting 22, 23 autos. So it's pretty nice stuff. Um, those will be in the stores um, Monday morning at 10 a.m. And you can get your teams through the store on Monday morning. All right, we have a 0 to 60 of Shane Bieber. And a 65 of Alex Bregman for the Astros. Love the 65 cards. Best best set they've done in here on as far as the uh, extras this year. That one had two. Okay, one with three. Hey, Oakland, what's up, man? Just doing a little test and stuff, getting the equipment ready. We're going to go back live on Monday. But you're welcome if you want anything, let me know. 
Got a bunch of new stuff in the store. Texas was good. My son and daughter-in-law, ex-daughter-in-law, got back together and moved to Tennessee. So we couldn't have asked for a better summer with the kids. So I'm happy about that. Got a 86 All-Star Chris Sale. And a 65 Bobby Dahlbach rookie. This is a giant box from... Target. Yeah, that was a really good thing. Took a little extra time. That's why I'm not getting back till after the national. But uh, Trevor Rogers rookie picked up a bunch of stuff in Texas and online, and got some cases of stuff. There's select hobby in the store. There's um, jumbo, some series one. And two in the store. Got hobby boxes from one and two. Another one of the Juan Sotos. A week to remember. Number 26. And Otani on the 65. How about them Cubbies trading away the whole team? <laughs> Told you it was. I'm not impressed. I do like the fact that they at least did it uh, multi-tiered so you get multiple versions of the guys. That'll help a little bit as far as money goes. But there's just nobody in that stuff. Whereas the baseball, it's 250 cards. And, uh, oh, did you have the did you have the Timberwolves? Cool. Yeah, I like that. That was a pretty card. I like Edwards. I think he's actually probably the best player in there. I'm, I don't think LaMelo Ball is going to be the big dog down the road. Personally. Uh, I do have some basketball. I got some soccer stuff in there we picked up. Got a bunch of... Uh... Yeah, I was out talking with him the other day. I'm going out to the show again tomorrow morning early to see if we can pick up any deals. Everything was so expensive. I only spent about 100 bucks, but I found a couple of cool things for myself. Ooh, nice. Alex Krilloff. Short prints. There we go. So this box has had a short print and an out of 99 so far. That's a nice uh, Krilloff. Better than his regular. Altuve on the silver. And McCutcheon on the 65. Oh, they did? They traded Austin? I did not know that. I didn't watch what they did. Who'd they trade him to? Please say the Cubs or the Rangers. Oh, God. They went to the Twins? Ah, for Berrios. Ah, there you go. Hey, how about um, um, Alcantara going to the uh, Cubs for, uh, for Rizzo? And they got the kid from the Mets, too. Cubs are a mess, but man, did they pick up some great players, and they'll re-sign Rizzo next year. He already said he's only going to be a rental first baseman for the Yankees. He doesn't want to play for him. He'll be back. He'll be a Cub again next year. Question is, can we get back uh, Baez or uh, Bryant? We'll sign two of the three. It's just we won't get them all. But man, they picked up a bunch of good prospects. Pete Crow Armstrong from the Mets. And Madrigal and Cody Heer, rookies from the uh, White Sox for the closer. So, they got some good guys. Yeah, he, and Rizzo. They're all three gone. Rizzo to the Yankees. The Mets got Baez and the Giants got Bryant. 
But they got some good people in the trade for them. How about better than the Rangers got? 70 years, Greg Maddox. A Krill off 65. Oh, I agree. But they weren't going to win this year, obviously, because they were playing like crap. Now at least they can get the little kids up and let them play and see what happens. Develop some talent. I mean, their offense stunk with all those guys in there. Baez made three errors in a game last week, cost them the game. Throwing the ball away to first. And you can't expect Rizzo to save every one of them. Bregman home run challenge. And 86 U Darvish in his Padre uniform. And a Verlander in the 65. I totally agree with you, man. I totally agree with you. Well, I'm just glad to be home. I've been in Texas for a month and Tennessee for a week and finally get to come home and relax a little bit and get started on uh, all the stuff I bought all summer. All right, you get a third. Juan Soto working on the farm. Oh, card number one. Very nice. I like these. These are nice. Molina, 65. Yeah, I'm going to have to sit down and look at all the rosters and see where everybody went. I have no clue where everybody went off to. I mean, the Cubs... Yeah, you know, still have a lot of guys on there that we know. It's just we don't know where they're going. <laughs> I mean, who's going to be the full-time shortstop? I guess Nico? Oh, and Schwarber went to the Red Sox? Holy cats. Nationals sold out, too. All right, 199. That's a red sparkle. Ramon Lariano. There you go. Uh, these boxes are pretty good so far. Only done this first one of these I've done. And a 65 Bo Bichette. Anyway. 16 box hobby stadium club case PYT number one will be in the store Monday morning at 10 along with PYT number one of Gypsy Queen 10 box hobby case there'll be 23 to 24 autos in the uh, Gypsy Queen and we'll get 32 or 33 autos in the stadium club all of these are on card Unless we get a chrome auto in the stadium club, which is a sticker. So 99% of the autos we're going to get are on card. Which will be very nice. Alright, we have a Hank Aaron, 70 years of tops. That's on the 2017. Very nice. And Aaron Judge on the 65. Yeah, so are the Cubs and so are the Rangers. Dodgers are loaded. 
Uh, the White Sox are loaded. They basically filled all the holes they needed to to win the uh, to win the American League. So, could be a possibility of Dodgers and uh, White Sox or Dodgers and uh, Padres. I could see either one of those. Jazz Chisholm rookie. And Ken Giles for the Blue Jays. Silver. Ted Williams, 86 All-Star. 6-to Sanchez rookie Marlins on the 65. I know Red Sox don't count them out, but I don't know if they're going to have the guys to get by uh, the White Sox, though. Pretty good team. Kind of like the fact the Yankees made all those trades and everything, gave up all their prospects, and they still won't win because <laughs> they don't have any pitching. Garrett Crochet for the White Sox. And our fourth Soto, Keeping Hope Alive. So you get four of those in a monster box. Number 17. And Eloy Jimenez, White Sox 65. Hopefully you get one more decent insert. Got a couple of good ones already. These are good boxes. Hey, Merv, how's it going, man? Got your emails? You'll have all your teams. Just going to do, doing a little break, checking all the video stuff, make sure everything works. Rewired, we put direct wiring in, so hopefully it won't be a problem anymore. Schwarber, no more Wi-Fi. Yay. Still having some issues with the upload speed, but the download speed is like 600 now. But we think we got issues in the line. Yeah, it was a good vacation. Uh, ended up as, anytime you can get your son and daughter-in-law to get back together and do the right thing, it's a good vacation. They're both in Tennessee now, and I don't have to transport anymore. I'm good. <laughs> Um, Merv, I do have some cards here from that last break we did. I'll make sure I get those to you here pretty quick. I, for whatever reason, I forgot to put them in the mail before we left. And that I am sorry about. I got everybody else's stuff out. Your little box is sitting there. Sam Huff rookie for the Rangers. Ew, parallel. I'd rather have a base. Juan Soto, best since Barry. That is the blue parallel. That'll be a little bit more. Nice card. I like the blue background. It's got to be blue instead of black. Because the black should be numbered. That's not numbered, so it's blue. I like these. These are neat cards. Got a Steve Carlton Platinum Players. I ah, appreciate it, man. We got a bunch of stuff coming pretty quick. I'll just send one big box. Should have come down to the Nationals. It was uh, overwhelming as usual. I spent all day over there Thursday. Spent 100 bucks. Bought a couple of little boxes of eyeball stuff and... A couple of cards I was looking for for John and for me. Tatis on a 65 Padres. And that was it. Everything else was too damn expensive. Florial. So I'm going tomorrow hoping they've come down on the prices. I think overall, yeah, the prices were just too high. If you were into all that speculating on high dollar stuff, you had a good time. I spent most of my time over in the vintage side, going through old vintage and looking at stuff, and uh, decided that it was that it was too high at the show. 
But uh, I did pick up some lesser stuff that I was looking for. Ooh. Chrome 65 Ian Anderson rookie. Very nice. Last pack. A little chrome refractor action. Very nice. I was hoping we'd get one of those box. Ian Anderson 86 Braves. And my PC this year, Dylan Carlson, 65 Rook. So I did a break uh, with Rip City last week on a case of uh, Gypsy Queen. I took the Cardinals, the Rangers, the, golly, the Tigers, and who else did I get? Oh, my goodness. Anyway, I hit seven autos, including two Carlsons, one to 99, one base. Oh, I had Pittsburgh. I got a uh, Cabron Hayes auto and some variations. So, I, mean, I was just stoked on that break. And they weren't too bad. All right. So, the big cards in this box. How about an Alex Curl off variation? No autos, no jerseys, but okay with that. Ron Hayes rookie and Anderson Silver. Ramon Laureano out of 199. But the reason I open this stuff, these cards right here. We got a Soto parallel and four Soto. So you'll get four of the Soto cards for 40 bucks in the giant box. And these are only available in the Target. Make sure you order the Target regulars. Uh, a lot of the boxes that Target was shipping on their Series 2 were just generic blasters. I only got five blasters out of 40 that had these cards in them. All of the uh, um, hanger boxes I ordered had these. And all the giant boxes had them. So I got 35 extra generic Series 2 boxes to get rid of. Anyway. So that's what you get in a giant box. Not too shabby. We would also got the Abreu out of 99 vintage stock. So that was kind of neat. Looks like the video system is working okay. If we can get things to... There we go. Alright. No spinning on your part, guys. Everything good? Oh, yeah. Let me... Uh... Let me show you some stuff. Oh. Here's some of the uh, some of the autos. I like the way they did them with the white. So the guy signed right down in the middle of all of them, all on card. So there's Nate Pearson for the Blue Jays, Funkhouse for the Tigers, Possel, Rangers, Abreu for the Yankees, Andy Young, Keegan Aiken for the Baltimore, got an out of 50 mini Patino for the Padres. Tanner Hawk for the Red Sox. There you go, Oakland fan. There's one for you. Uh, Medina for the Phillies. Kramer Orioles. Got a uh, Peterson. Mets out of 50, black and white. Yajur for the Yankees. Marshawn for the Phillies. Oh, there's more. You know me. I went nuts on it as usual. Evan White. Dane Dunning, White Sox, who's actually now a Ranger. Uh, Espinal for the Blue Jays. Tejada Rangers. Here's one of the Dylan Carlsons I got. And there's an Anderson Tejada Blue out of 99 for the Rangers. Yomer Mercedes for the White Sox. A Nick Madrigal for the White Sox, now a Cub. That's out of 50. 
Got a nice out of 99, Luis Roberts. Another Espinal. This is the cool one. Box topper, Juan Soto Gold. That is number three of 25. Juan Soto. Well, that was the case hit. I was very pleased with that. Cabron Hayes, Tejada, Sam Huff, another Funk House, another Sam Huff, another Cabron Hayes. This is the other kid the White Sox traded with uh, Nico or um, um, uh, Madrigal. So my, uh, the Cubs got Madrigal and Hewer for the closer. I thought that was a great deal. And then here's the blue Dylan Carlson to 99. And I still got a couple of more. Like I said, I went a little nuts myself. Mitch White for the Dodgers. This is one of the script parallels. It's not numbered. Got a Joe Adele. But check this out. Bazooka back out of 25. Joe Adele. Dylan Carlson. Apostle. A Jesus Sanchez out of 50. Another Aiken. Arias. Karanchik. So there are Indians autos for Kevin. A Jazz Chisholm. Just a base. Diaz. And... Got a Kenta Maeda, number 42. That's the Jackie Robinson I got out of the case. I like the cards. They are nice looking this year. They did no names. They did a script instead of a missing team name. And then they went straight to parallels. Uh, they did do bazooka backs on the base cards again, too. And then the minis. I got uh, two bazooka back autos. I got the Joe Adele, and we hit something else too. Let me see what it was. Yeah, Sam Huff. So really, really happy about the Sam Huff too. That's another one I'm kind of keeping my eye on. Nice catcher for the Rangers. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of good ones. The Pirates would be good with Cabron. Um, I've seen a lot of uh, um, Phillies hit well and have some guys on there. Uh, I haven't seen many Braves autos yet, but it may just be. Uh, Padres are good, but there is no uh, Tatis auto. He didn't sign in this. Which kind of surprised me, but there are other guys, but just not Tatis. Uh, the other one thing we got was there are patch autos again this year. And I got a Pete Alonzo out of 50. And this is all out of hobby because I haven't seen any retail yet. I had three cases of retail blasters ordered and they cut my order to give it to Walmart and Target. Good job, guys. You can't even get it from Target. But nice on card. Look really good this year. Padres should be good. Look on Cardboard Connection. They'll give you the checklist. You can do it by the uh, breakdown on the team so you can see what cards each one have and the autos. Looks pretty good. I checked it out the other day myself. Uh, I've got to figure out how to price the teams and stuff. So we shall see.